Hello there, Patia. It's Dr. Ian at the Bangkok Hospital, Patia. And today I'm in the Brain Center. With me is Dr. Decha, who is one of our um, surgeons in the Brain Center. A neurosurgeon, we call them. Dr. Decha, welcome to the program. Explain for our viewers what exactly does a neurosurgeon do? Mm -hmm. Uh, like the, the surgeon, the nurse, we mainly focus on the, the treatment of the, the brain and the spinal cord disease. But the, the main treatment of neurosurgeon is to do the surgery on the brain, the skull, and also the spinal cord. Right. What conditions do you see that require you to actually go in and do neurosurgery on the brain? Okay. Actually, there, is, uh, there are a lot of conditions that need uh, the surgical treatment by the neurosurgeon. But uh, in our community, the mainly is still on the, the patient with the damage to the brain, mm -hmm. like the accident, the motorcycle accident without a helmet, falling. Mm -hmm. uh, after that is the stroke patient. We can do the surgery for both uh, the ischemic stroke and hemorrhagic stroke. Right. Mm -hmm. This is where there's a bleed in the brain. That's the hemorrhagic stroke. Mm -hmm. The ischemic stroke is where there's a blockage in one of the arteries in the brain. So Dr. Dechar can fix both. Neurosurgery is actually one of the oldest forms of medicine. Because right. when you look back in history, trephining was done by the, the Romans. Yes, uh, it's quite amazing that if we see, we find or read in the, the history to do the surgery, that very complex mm. in the brain. But there is the, the evidence for that. But right now, uh, there is a lot of things change. The technique, the equipment, and the knowledge, the new knowledge. We have to say, until now, we, we still have a lot of things we don't know. Right. But it, we, found, we found everything new mm. every day. Yeah. As we were saying, trephining, drilling a hole in the skull, oh, yeah. this was done thousands of years ago. Yeah. But we have no knowledge as to how the patient did afterwards. Right, right. <laughs> Mo we have to say, most of the patient underwent trephining at that time. Mm. Yes. <laughs> but right now, nearly mm. zero percent. Right. Mm -hmm. Now, you mentioned um, new technology, new techniques. What, what are these? Uh, most, the mainly is to the instrument we use during the operation. Mm -hmm. We have the, the sophisticated design, the small instrument. Because of to do the surgery in the brain is really fine st structure, mm -hmm. and we need uh, right now we have the, the microscope that help we to do the surgery. We we can see exactly what we are doing mm -hmm. at what area, right? Okay? And uh, we have the microscope. We have the the micro surgical instrument, mm -hmm. and that we is. A lot of the, the technology we, we brought in to use, like uh, the navigation, mm -hmm. like the design of the equipment, the, the shunt system for the treatment of hydrocephalus, which right now we, we improve a lot of things. Like uh, we can use the control, the remote control, to adjust the pressure after we do the surgery. Goodness. We can make a small hole to remove the tumor or to do the biopsy at the very difficult area, the deep area. Mm. Just only a, a little uh, incision. Right. How, how long does the usual, the most likely operations uh, take? Are, are these sort mm -hmm. of 10 hour operations or what? Uh, it depends on the, the, the condition we, we, we perform. Mm -hmm. uh, the easiest uh, procedure may just only 30 minutes. But the most difficult thing, we don't know. Maybe 
more than 10 hours. The longest we can we 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 did in Pattaya Hospital is uh, 12 hours. Goodness for the brain tumor. Okay, Dr. Deja, thank you very much indeed, and I hope you're enjoying these Healthwise programs. They're designed to give you an interest in what's going on, an interest in your own body, and remember, if you are feeling not well, listen to your own body and come in and see us. This is Dr. Ian and Dr. Dechar saying thank you for being with us today. Thank you.